Oh, get in my back. <clears throat> yeah, I know. I know what you're going to say. Health and safety. <clears throat> well, I've done it safely. All grown by myself. A very satisfying feeling. Bonnie, what are you after? We're going this way, Mia. We'll go out in the field. Go on. Yeah, you look, this is my veranda, not yours. Go on. Off you go. Off you go. Look at this, cow parsley starting to grow up. Good sign, it'll soon be spring. And that's called uh, Lords and Ladies. Yeah, so look, even the docks. We're getting near spring, and today the temperature is uh, 52 Fahrenheit. I've been sweating this morning, perspiring rather. <laughs> oh no, I'm a bloke, I sweat. Yeah, so I've had to take my jacket off. We're just having a little wander up and down the field. <clears throat> it's a lovely day, isn't it, Mia? Why have you stopped? Do you have enough? Do you want to carry on? Good girl. She's not sure. Neither of us can walk very far these days. Very tempted to go out for a motorbike ride again this afternoon on the uh, Royal Enfield Himalayan. Uh, sportsters in in with Andy at Legends motorbikes having a bit of a service in an MOT goes around comes around very quickly the MOTs if you ask me another year gone a lot of the bits of rubbish you see at the edge of this field um, they blow over from the village over there and the wind that's south west and that's our prevailing wind <clears throat> in this country I think that's the prevailing wind all over the Great Britain and uh, it just it just blows over and then you've got people who set balloons off People still don't understand what they're doing with these balloons. But I don't want to be moaning about stuff. I think I better go back actually. I'm feeling quite tired. In a busy morning. See these cable reels here? Well, that's my contribution to the rubbish, but I put them there for a seat for myself. I found them at the edge of the railway, they belong to the railway people really, but they make a nice seat. I can just sit here, can't I Mia? When it all gets too much for me. Hey Mia. Look at this branch. Good bird's nesting holes on this branch, but unfortunately it's 
it's fallen off, it's an elder. I'll try and push it back that way. No, I don't think it's gonna go. It's too heavy for me. Yeah. The woodpecker has been at this and look at all the woodworm in it. You get quite a few meals out of this old elder tree. This is the railway line, it's called the Track Paralleling Hut, full of electrical stuff. And you see the graffiti lads have been here. They can't leave anything alone. Even this new box has not been graffitied on. We are a funny lot, aren't we, us human race? Supposed to be the most intelligent people on the planet, species on the planet. <laughs> Got serious doubts about that. And here's another sign of spring. The snowdrops are just about to burst into bloom life renewed you two are going to have to move I'm going to be cutting wood here all three of you Hens all over the place. Come on, you've got to go. That's it. Free firewood, free warmth. You get warm while you're cutting it, and you get warm while you're burning it. Hello. <laughs> bonnie, bonnie, bonnie. Oh, thank you. Showing us that. <laughs> yeah, she's a bonnie cat. Oh, she's a bonnie cat. Just a quick vid, show you what not to. Bye for now. Bye. <laughs>